Hey guys, I'm Adam with Amtac Suppressors. A little while ago we put out a video where Greg talked about handling hot suppressors. And there's a lot of good information in there, but one of the questions we got quite often was, what about suppressor covers? Uh, do they have a place? Do we use them? Um, you know, what are the advantages and disadvantages? Uh, the answer to that is, yes, they have a place. Yes, we do use them. And yes, they have a lot of advantages. Uh, so we looked around a lot for really good suppressor cover and what we came up with was the rifles only heat abatement device or HAD. Uh, this is a two-piece suppressor cover. Uh, it has an internal sleeve that is rated to 3000 degrees working temperature. It can actually handle intermittent temperature up to 3500 degrees. And the outside sleeve is Cordura on the outside and another high temp material on the inside which can handle up to 2000 degrees of sustained temperature. And then the entire thing is wrapped together with super high temp cord that actually has a higher working temperature than either one of those. So it's just about impossible to ruin this thing. Uh, rifles only suggests no more than four full auto mag dumps through a 5.56. So that's a lot of shooting. Obviously a bolt gun like this, it's not even a consideration. Um, the way that these things work is you slide the suppressor cover over the suppressor. You slide the external cover over the high temp material and then you tie everything in place with these cords. So you want to kind of creep your way along and pull those cords down tight like you're you know, snugging up your shoes really tight. That last cord, when you first put it on, it's going to seem like there's too much cord there, but what you're actually doing is you're going to go through the little loop and then you're going to go over the top of the barrel behind the suppressor, not around the cover. You're going to go through that little bottom loop again and then you're going to put your toggle on there. And what that does is it actually puts a cord behind the suppressor and ties the suppressor cover onto the suppressor from the back. Because what happens is if you don't have something to hold it in place, as you're shooting, recoil will slowly start creeping that suppressor forward. And then you're going to have a bunch of suppressor cover hanging over the end of your suppressor. Um, it's not really a dangerous thing, but it just kind of you know takes away from some of the effectiveness of the cover. And it also, if you get it out there far enough, you might have some little strikes, which is going to cause accuracy problems. So uh, suppressor covers are great for handling hot suppressors because you can just hang on to them and it's going to be just as effective as you know welding glove, welding blanket, any of those other things that we use all the time, except it's always attached to the suppressor. A uh, couple of considerations though is that eventually you do want your suppressor to be able to cool down if you get it really, really hot. Uh, what you'll see a lot of people, things like PRS matches do, so you get the gun sitting in the rack and the suppressor cover will be, be back here over the barrel while the suppressor is exposed. And all they're doing is just sliding that thing back so the suppressor itself can cool down. Uh, as a result, you can see that both ends of the suppressor cover, the suppressor is exposed because that heat does have to go somewhere. Uh, but even with all that, suppressor covers do a great job uh, mitigating mirage. And uh, we like these guys so much that we actually brought them in and we're selling them in the store now. So if you go and you buy a suppressor, you're getting some other swag or something, uh, right there on the Amtac store are the rifles only suppressor covers available in the two sizes that fit our 7.7 .7 and our 9.7 inch suppressors. So if you guys have any questions about these, you can go ahead and leave them up in the comments. And for anything else, you can go to AmtacSuppressors.com.